welcome to a little bit of a car vlog session because I'm just on the way to the gym this morning and I thought we'd vlog today because I have it's my Monday there's a lot to do however the kids are off so it's going to be a hectic Monday it's um we've had our half term here it is now um they've got an inset day today so um Matt is at home with them at the moment I'm going out to go to the gym early um, I have slept funny and pulled a muscle in the middle of my back which is really, making it really difficult to breathe do you know what's really frustrating <laughs> we'll go to the gym I will lift all these weights and I put my back out by breathing funny or sleeping funny um, and it really irritates me when that happens because I just think like why today's video is kindly sponsored by HelloFresh which I'm really excited to work with again I've been working with them on a monthly basis because they have really just helped me like I say with my um, diet and lifestyle they fit they're slotting in really well and really nice and I'm happy to continue to work with them keep around for me sharing a little bit about HelloFresh later and also sharing my discount code with you guys yes, so I thought I'd let you know that so I'm off to the gym today with my sister-in-law Nick and we are I don't even know what day we're doing today but I thought I would bring you with me and we'll do a gym workout and then I'm going to pop to home bargains on the way back because I've got a list of things to get I'm supposed to be going cleaning at my father-in-law's today but I'm not sure if I'm going to switch that day um because me and um Matt's mom alternate on going to clean so I'm going to potentially switch that day because my beautiful friend Leanne is coming around later she comes around um, on a Monday um, and she's been on holiday last week so I wanted to catch up with her oh, and it's my birthday this week it's my birthday on Friday um, yeah it's my birthday on Friday I'm going to be closer to 40 than 30 not having a midlife crisis at all <laughs> Um, it's one of those things, isn't it? Like you, you always get people who are old, and you say, "Oh, yeah, that's so young. You've still got your whole life ahead." But then you're thinking, 18 was a very long time ago." <laughs> it's so bizarre. It's like, "Oh my God, that was like 20 years, nearly 20 years ago." Ah, oh gosh. Um, so yeah, it's just one of those things, isn't it? But I'm actually really, I really, do you know what? I really look forward to my birthday now. Like I, I had a couple of years, when I turned 30, I think I had a little bit of a breakdown, I'm not going to lie. And I don't know why, because I was actually really excited to turn 30, but then after I turned 30, I was like, oh my gosh, this is like, I'm getting old now, older. Um, and then from then on, from that birthday where I was really down, I'm like, now I really embrace it. And I, I'm, I like almost celebrate that I've made another year. And I think it's really important to celebrate your birthday. Like my mum, she's 80. Um, and she's like, oh, oh, you know, I count backwards. And I'm like, mum, every birthday we should celebrate so, so much that we are still here. Like it is a privilege to grow old. Um, and so, yeah, I, I have that like outlook on life now. And so Matt always laughs at me, but I make like my birthday week. So I wake, woke up this morning and I was like, it's my birthday week. <laughs> what are we gonna do this week everybody's gonna do as i say but i think my week is going to be filled with early nights <laughs> and some pampering i'm going to retone my hair because i had a bit of a brain wave about that i thought instead of dyeing it because my roots aren't terrible i'm going to just retone it so it just brightens it up a little bit for my birthday i've got my nails booked in on thursday um yeah and that's about it really but I'm almost at the gym I am 17 minutes late Nicola is going to be fuming with me here. A bush. why do I always pick the tightest space I mean I could have picked any space but no I tried to pick one I can barely fit in so right, guys, there's some bush beeping at me. Right, off I go to the gym. Late. Whoopsies. Okay. 
Okay, so today is a new plan. I'm starting off with some squats. So this is like a, a nice warm-up set. Um, I'm trying to work on my form on this one. And I'm actually really, really pleased with how my form is on this one. But then I'm going to go heavier onto like my working sets. And, um, oh, <laughs> there's Nicola for you. Um, yeah, I definitely didn't get the depth that I wanted to on these squats. But to be honest, it's a work in progress. I'm quite happy with doing 60 at all because 60 kilograms is kind of my max on this at the moment. So yeah, I was pleased to get three out on those. Um, and then we are doing RDLs. Now this is one thing that I love about um, filming in the gym because I can totally pick my form apart. I can see that I'm bending my knees a little bit too much. I'm kind of in between an RDL and a deadlift here. So I know for next time to keep my legs a bit um, stronger. And then finally we had walking lunges. So we've got 20 kilos on our back and we did have to do three twos and fro's of these. I am not a massive fan of walking lunges, but they replaced split squats. So I don't know which is the lesser of two evils, but to be honest, um, I can feel the burn a couple of days after. So they definitely did do their magic and it was nice to switch it up a little bit. So then as promised, I popped into Home Bargains just to have a browse and see what they had. I had a list of things to get. So I thought I would just take you with me and show you a few things in here. These are all the dupes of the um, Sol de Janeiro stuff. They had so much more in today, but I didn't get anything else. The um, summer section, I loved those plastic jugs and glasses. I had some very similar from here years ago that I still have and that I love. And I loved all like the lemon theme, those orange little baskets there. They had so many cute things in here. I could have got so many things, but... I actually really like that lemon cool bag. I may go back to get that. They got that cute little strawberry water dispenser down there and those little tumblers, those glass and bamboo um, glasses. I had them last year and I love them. There they are up on the top as well. Um, I love those for iced coffee. They've come in so, so useful um, and I use them all year round. So highly recommend those. And yeah, this is more of the like fruit theme following through so they had all like these melanine it was like melanine but it had like a um, a matte finish to it which was really nice um and then yeah all the father's day stuff was in as well i've actually got picked up a few things from matt from this section i don't normally get a lot for father's day but they had these really nice matching pajamas for um men and boys and it had like it was like the top gun theme but top dad i'm just trying to see if they are they are in this clip but they're not but yeah if you want something for father's day they had tons in this aisle like so so much and then they also had loads of um, really nice pajamas in i almost got those blue and white flower ones every time i go in i look at them but i'm just not sure about the long sleeves those are really cute as well those corally ones yeah love the pajamas in home bargains and then they had this cute little dog oil on the end for the dogs for this summer which is great right finished at the gym didn't do the cardio which was the rower because i have then had a brisk walk up to home bargains and asda I wanted to get the new zaflora which is the p no something in nectarine sweet nectarine or something but I, they didn't have the spray but I smelt the liquid and I'm not a fan I prefer my favorite one is the peony I think it's called like peony blush or something and it's from um the peony one anyway and it's from B&M they only do it in B&M they don't do it in home bargains um so I need to go and get some more of that I love that in the summer and then I love the um cranberry and orange for winter um <laughs> what else did I get? I'll show you a little haul when I get back. I didn't get much more than that. Um, some of my faves from Home Bargains. So I will unbox that with you when I get home. But yeah, successful day at the gym, as you saw. Um, that was the first. So basically, I have a plan for four weeks. And then I have a new plan every four weeks. And this is the day. This is the start of my new plan. So I've never done that day before. Um, which is good because obviously... 
you like get by the end of your four weeks you're really really good at the exercises in the plan and then you go in really heavy and you're doing really well and then you, you switches it up so now i've got different exercises that that a little bit target different muscle groups um so today was leg day walking lunges were new for me as you probably would have seen i hate walking lunges but to be honest i never liked split squats but i got quite used to them at the end of the last training period so you know you just you just learn to adapt and you get on with it and i think muscle mem muscular memory got massive like as soon as you do things repetition 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 um it seems easier because you like your muscular memory like your body gets better at remembering the exercises which is good so yeah always feel better once i've been to the gym um i have one of i really need to go to bed earlier though because i am really tired um already it's like quarter to 12 um i just feel so tired already so yeah i'll catch up with you in a bit guys Hello Fresh have kindly sponsored today's video which I'm so so grateful for I really appreciate that because working with brands like that allows me to continue to create content on this channel so I'm really grateful to Hello Fresh and grateful for you guys for watching this portion of the video if you don't know Hello Fresh are a delivery service that delivers fresh ingredients directly to your door so you can create recipes hundreds of recipes to choose from and the one thing I love about Hello Fresh that has made it really easy in my weight loss journey is that they have calorie smart meals Meals where you can look at the breakdown of the macronutritional values. I feel like HelloFresh has fitted into my routine. I feel like it's really convenient. And, and yeah, I really like how everything's portioned out for me. So HelloFresh have kindly given me a code, which I will leave on the screen here. And I also have a QR code, which I will leave here for you. And this code will get you 60% off your first box and 25% off for the next two months. And it's still on, guys, the free desserts for life. If you do get HelloFresh, please don't forget to use my code or click this QR code here and get yourself some free desserts for life. I highly recommend them. I love to use them. Thank you again so, so much for sponsoring today's video. Okay, I just thought I'd do a quick home bargains haul because I've not long got back. Um, so I've got like five minutes before I leave to get the boys up, but I thought I would quickly show you what I got. Um, so I picked up some more of the Listerine Smart Rinse. This is for kids six plus. This is only 99p and I get it every time I go in because it's such good value for money. It's way more expensive on Amazon. Um, I picked up some of these face and under arm wax strips. However, they're not very good. They were 99p, I tried one, didn't really pull any hairs out. So I won't be buying them again. I'll be sticking to Vite. Um, also picked up some as a flora. I got this one for my mum. This is in the, the scent Sweet Pea. Um, I love the Peony one, I think, which you, but you can only get that from B&M. And I went in to smell the new one, which is the Sweet Nectarine and Vanilla. I didn't like it. it. It smells exactly what it says, like oranges and vanilla, but it was just too sweet for me. I felt like when I clean with this, the house smells of whatever that is. And it was a bit too much. This sweet pea is very florally, but my mom loves sweet pea. So I thought I'd get that. I think they're around 250. Um, I got myself some more slow cooker liners. If you don't know, get to know. These are incredible to save on your washing up. Um, and then I got a few bits, um, gym wise i picked up some more of my favorite protein bars these are the bsn peanut crunch flavor they're like a snickers i've had these for years they're at 129 each so i picked up 20 of those because that's all i had um i got some more of this clear way isolate now last time i did a haul i said this was 7.99 it isn't it's 14.99 which changes things a little bit because to be fair that's about the same price as my protein um i got some more of it but i'm not i'm not 100 percent sold it's a bit frothy um i'd still take it but yeah i'm still not i, I, I still don't like it i'm still yet to find something then i picked up some more of my pre-workout this is my favorite one this is the delicious berry i do really recommend this one because some pre-workouts can make you really itchy this one doesn't and i think this is 5.99 and it lasts me a good month so yeah i picked that up um i thought i just read that it had creatine then but it hasn't 
misread it anyway and then finally i picked up some more bcas if you don't know bcas are for like muscle repair um, and i started to take these a lot because um my muscles need repairing a lot so this is in the freight in the fragrance in the taste or flavor cherry fantastic really like this reminds me of cherry drops when you smell it um yeah this is also 5.99 i think that's all i got so yeah, that was my little home bargain tour. It was only a little, not, nothing really exciting, but I thought I'd share it with you. Um, and anyway, I'm quickly now off to uh, go and get the kids. Hi guys, so it's a bit later on. I'm going to tone my hair. Basically, I normally dye my hair every six weeks, and I think it's been about four. Um, so it's not quite ready, but it's my birthday on Friday. And it's looking a tad bit yellow. I think it looks worse in real life than on the camera. So I'm just gonna give it a tone, um, which is really good because it's something you can just do in between dyes. I'm out of breath from coming up the stairs. Whew. Anyway, so I use the Blonde Me Pastel Toning and I use it in shade Ice um, and I'll only need half a tube. Uh, I get mine from a beauty warehouse, you can get it online. It's roughly around I want to say up to around 15 pounds a tube. I think it's about 12, 11, 12 pound plus VAT um, from where I get it from. I love, I love everything about this packaging. So cute. Um, and then this is the peroxide I used to go with it, which is the 2% 7 vol. It's basically just a peroxide. Like it's just basically a dis um, depositor. So it doesn't actually light in the hair at all it's just to deposit dye into the hair so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go and wash my hair first i'm just going to go and shampoo it um because you're supposed to put toner on to shampooed hair because the shampoo opens the co uh, cuticle to let the dye go in so i'm just going to go and quickly do that plus it's full of dry shampoo as well um so yeah i'm going to go and do that and then i'll have a little talk to you about my hair when I get back because I feel like I wanted to talk about it a little bit um on where we're at and what we're doing and where we're going so yeah let me just go and give this a shampoo okay so I've just had a shower I've just brushed my hair very very gently from the bottoms up um so obviously it's wet so it's most vulnerable when it's wet um and then I'm just trying gonna try and loosely part it um but not doesn't have to be too neat it's just so i can get the toner on evenly and then i normally just do this the same way as when i bleach just so i make sure i get every bit and that's why i do it into four quart like four quadrants so just do um four quarters basically so one and then these ones at the front are really tiny quarters two and then three and then the fourth one at the back there which i'll start with um yeah so i'm just gonna plonk some toner on that like i say it's half of this and then it's one to one ratio so um i will just use 30 mil of this 30 mil of that mix it together and then i'll be back in two seconds i'll show you what it looks like Okay, that is on now. It looks very purple. That's completely normal. I'll leave this on for like 20 minutes. So after 20 minutes, it doesn't develop anymore anyway. Um, really. So leave it for 20 minutes and then wash it off. And hopefully I'll have a little bit of a refresh and it won't look as yellow. I mean, it wasn't terrible before, but um, it's a nice little refresh for my birthday. So back in 20 minutes. So just out the shower now. As you can see, it's not purple. Um, it's just taken away some of the orangey tones, orangey, yellowy tones. Um, and then I've been using the Wow Kale Infused Dream Cocktail. I've been basically trying to use products religiously um, to really try and help my hair. And I do feel like it's helping. I don't know. It's, this is where it gets really difficult like you can't really put your finger on like what one thing it is that's helping but i do feel like it's a bit of everything that's helping if you get what i mean so the mixture of me using products to protect my hair every day and then i am 
not drawing with a hairdryer unless I really, really have to. I'm not using any heat whatsoever. Um, and I'm also making sure that I brush from the ends when it's wet. Um, I also use, <laughs> lost it, my unique one from Revlon. I get this from Amazon. I can leave it linked below. This is like, I love this stuff so much. Um, it just smells like holiday and I feel like if I had one hair product that I had to, well, apart from dry shampoo, because you can't live without dry shampoo, um, it would be this one, the unique one. Can't recommend that one enough. Um, let me sort this out. I don't want to be making my YouTube and OnlyFans. Um, and then I've just been, like I say, being really delicate with my hair when it's wet, um, brushing from the ends. And only drawing when I need to. I will probably draw it today with a hairdryer because I'm going out this morning with my dad. Going to Iceland. Because he gets his pensioner discount on a Tuesday. So he always takes me to Iceland. Um, which I'm very grateful for. But I can really tell a difference. Especially the one place I can really tell is at the front here. I know this probably looks still really thin and fine and wispy and crap. But this bit here never grows past like here it has never well i can't remember the last time it did um it's always just a bit that i can never grow and i don't know what i'm doing differently but it has grown and it's grown it's my hair falling out now it's grown thick to the end as well it's not like yeah and then my frazzled bit that when i had my last lot of highlights when it all broke off is grown as well it's about here that had snapped off to the root so it's definitely growing definitely looking better um, i'm just gonna quickly dry this and i'll be back in a second and here is the end result with it dry i'm really pleased with this actually just a nice little freshen up don't know why i didn't speak over this bit of the video who knows <laughs> hi guys so i'm back in this spot it's i don't even know where I was up to in this vlog, but I thought I would just come on to finish it off and quickly just show you a couple of bits that I've had from TikTok shop because um, I'm obsessed with buying stuff over there in the moment, it's my new obsession. <laughs> but I just had a couple of things that I thought would show you because genuinely, these are such good bargains. I don't know how I'm going to link these, but what I will do is if I link my TikTok below and you've got TikTok, um, you will just go on and you can click on like my show, it's called Showcase and I'm going to put all these items on there. So these are, this one's first like a gym thing. Um, if you are a gym goer, this is an incredible buy. This is a set of five resistance bands. It also comes with like these little attachments but they're not there for. Um, but this was £11.50 guys. And you get in there, wait, just wait. You get in there five bands. So you get, obviously they're different widths and strengths. Um, a green, purple, black, red, and yellow. I mean, the yellow one, <laughs> Matt said, elastic bands are thicker, but that is such a good bargain. These are really, really good for doing different exercises. Um, if you need some help doing like assisted pull-ups, assisted dips, as you will have seen in like some of my videos that I do. Um, but yeah, this is such a good bargain. On Amazon, the thick, the thick bands themselves are like, I'd say more than the whole set, like 15 pound for a good thick um, band. I didn't expect them to be any good, but they're brilliant. So I bought them to go in my gym bag. And then second of all, if you are a, if you to film, I got the viral tripod. Um, this is again so good value for money. I think it was about ten pounds, or no, I think it was twelve pound fifty. It is huge, right? But look how compact it is. So it's like this little tripod that you pull out. Okay, so. Look at this. And then it's got a little remote on it as well. You've got the um, stretchy thing for your phone, which you can rotate. 
and it's got a cold shoe adapter which is on the top here which means you can mount like a normal camera or a light and then look at this right let me just show you can you see it hold on there you go how tall is that like that's crazy so like you could film from up here it's very dark in here now um i'm losing light but anyway yeah how good is that like this little adjustable tripod and like i say it goes down to literally like nothing and that clicks into place so that is perfect like that would fit in your handbag um, but yeah, those are my two TikTok shop buys. I've actually got loads of stuff on the way. I've got a few um, dresses. Dresses? Yeah, I've got a couple of dresses and like a two-piece as well, which I'm hoping will be here. Um, it's my birthday tomorrow. That's how long I've been filming this vlog. This is like a weekly vlog now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. I always like it when I've got loads of different things to show you. And yeah. Uh, I will leave it there so thank you so much for watching if you did like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up I would love for you to subscribe and stick around and again thank you so much to HelloFresh for sponsoring this video again I will leave the QR code here and I will leave my discount code here if you want to take advantage of my offer um, but yeah thank you so much for watching guys until next time take care